Palestine. Free, free, free Palestine. Free, free, free Palestine. Free, free, free Palestine. We want justice, you say how? Arms and embargo now. We want justice, you say how? Arms and embargo now. 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 That's right. We need an arms embargo right now. And so long as politicians refuse to grant it, something they easily could do, a stroke of the pen, and this brutal massacre is over, we will be here fighting and enacting a people's arms embargo against companies like Maersk, some of the leading supply chain companies most responsible for the genocide of our people in Gaza. Right now there are people, right now, collecting signatures for Maersk, passing out flyers. Please see them. Please take the flyers for our Monday night volunteer meeting every Monday at the 6.30 at the People's Forum so we can continue building a movement for a People's Arms Embargo. And not only is a People's Arms Embargo needed for justice and freedom and peace in Palestine and the world over, but also for the general people of the world. When the United States sent THAAD, the THAAD defense system, to Israel, we realized, we learned that this had already been in Korea for many years. And the people of Korea had been resisting this system for many years. The people of Korea also are fighting for a people's arms embargo. And I'm going to call up a leading Korean organization and a leader in this fight, Elliot from No Duto, to address us more about the necessity for this arms embargo right now. In the ground, no bombs in the air. No in the air. USA out of everywhere. USA out of everywhere. No boots on the ground, no bombs in the air. No boots on the ground, no bombs in the air. USA out of everywhere. No boots on the ground, no bombs in the air. for Korean Community Development. We are just three days away from Election Day. Three days before the deceitful spectacle they put on every four years to tell us that democracy is on the line. We call bullshit. They are lying to us. What kind of democracy, what kind of democratic nation spoon feeds its citizens only two candidates for an election that no matter what the outcome will result in a morally bankrupt, depraved, genocidal funding executive office. What democracy, the kind where they send more bombs more warships, more planes, to kill tens of thousands of Palestinian, Lebanese, and Yemeni children, women, men, and journalists who dare to resist the deadly occupation. As anti-imperialist Koreans, we stand here today to tell Trump and Harris, the two faces of the same ruling class, that we will not let any party get away with committing genocide of the Palestinian people. You may have seen a Korean elder, Do Gun Yan. The sign says, 
I hate all Korea, uh, American presidents. Biden, Trump, Harris, we hate all of them. She is a village elder in a small farming village of Sosungiri in Korea, where the U.S. deployed hundreds of troops and billion dollar missile systems called THAAD. The same missile systems the U.S. deployed to Israel. She knows, and we know, that every single time the U.S. props up an election, they are lying. She knows, and we know, the Democrats and the Republicans, every president they put up is a deadly, bloodthirsty president to dominate every region in the world. So yeah, democracy is on the line, but it won't be decided on November 5th. Every hour, every day, how we act and what we will do to fight against U.S. imperialism is when we decide democracy. (laughs) Palestinians have challenged the imperialist narrative that the U.S. is not the defender of democracy, but only a death merchant of people fighting for liberation, for their love of of their land and people. So comrades, here in Noruto, anti-imperialists across the world, we will fight with you until you return to your rivers, until you return to your trees, until you return to your oceans, and you return to your land until Palestine is free! Free, free Palestine! 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 Free